Aquarius, thank you so much for being here. Today we're going to be doing your October reading. This is going to be a general reading, career and love. We're going to cover all topics. Let's go. <laughs> so we're going to start off with the numerology cards. These are my favourite cards at the moment. I absolutely love them. So let's see, what does Aquarius need to know right now and what's going to happen to them in October? I'm seeing, I'm seeing a sense of stuckness. I'm getting the word stuck and it's like really bold letters. So I feel like you're very stuck at the moment. So we have financial discipline. We have domestic harmony. We have environment. Do I want these cards? Do we want these cards? No, I don't want these cards. Sorry guys, I'm gonna, I'm gonna shuffle again. I'm not too keen on those cards. No, I don't like that. If it comes up again and they're meant to come up, but okay. Right, communication. <laughs> okay, communication, 33, sorry guys. Clumps of cards are coming out. I don't know which ones to choose, so. Okay. What else does Aquarius need to know? I'm getting a circle. This is kind of weird. So any of you who are, this is kind of something quite intimate. So if you're over the age, the legal age to be intimate with another person, uh, make, sure, <laughs> make sure if you're not over the age to, uh, if you're not legal in terms of, you know, sex, cover your ears. I'm here, I'm seeing like a ball gag <laughs> for some of you guys. Don't know why, I think it's like, I don't think it's a sexual thing though. I think it's like, you can't talk about something and you're really like, mm, like someone's like taped up your mouth and you're like, mm, I can't talk. Um, and you're like, ah, I'm stuck. And you're like trying to pull it and grab it and rip it off, but you can't. It's like, I can't, I don't know what to do. That's basically what I feel like is happening. Um, stuck. I just feel stuck with you guys. I'm getting a spiral as well. So maybe you feel like you're going in a circle. Yeah. Okay. So for you guys, we have, whoa, it's got a massive whoosh. Oof, that pushed me back. You know when you, you, know when you get up too fast from sitting down? I, I just got that. <laughs> so we have communication and individuality, 33 and 11. So look out for those two numbers. Uh, we also have self-discipline, 41. Um, and final, financial discipline. So yeah, that was meant to come out, financial discipline for you guys. So I'm not sure what financial discipline means because we've got self-discipline, we've got financial discipline. So maybe there's a lot of you guys who are feeling stuck because maybe there's not really a direction and you're needed to direct your energy in some sort of area, but you're not sure what area that is. So I see that you guys are really going to have to focus on that element. You know, there's going to be something you need to focus on. I don't know what it is, but there's possibly just you need to set yourself goals because I feel like your energy is like this, like fluttering around. Um, and there's maybe some communication needing to be had. <sighs> I'm seeing a lot of like secure, I'm getting like the word security. Um, I'm, getting, I'm seeing like a man in a suit and it's very like cold. I'm getting that, like a cold gray energy. Like he's very sad with his job. He's very like, he's a businessman. I'm not getting like anything wholehearted. It's very like businessy. So maybe you need to be very kind of disciplined with how you're approaching your money. Or maybe you're too focused on money this month and you need to kind of sway away from that and kind of get a bit more happiness and emotion. I feel like your energy is quite grey at the moment and you're feeling, I feel like you need to get some colour in your life. And I feel like that can happen by um, injecting some some fun, some childlike nature and possibly just communicate about how you really feel. Possibly write it down, talk to somebody, talk to a friend, talk to a family member, member that sort of thing. We also have friendship. As I said, yeah, talk to a friend. Uh, communication, seek out your soul family, surround yourself with pos positive people, spend more time socializing, okay? That's really gonna help you. We've got a lot of red and yellow here and orange, so I feel like it's a lot of solar plexus and sacral energy here. So being very grounded, but also very kind of like, I'm getting quite graphic visuals. Like I'm seeing like, yeah, I say a ball and ball and chain as well. Like, I'm seeing like you're being chained up. Like I'm seeing like a like a chain around your ankle, like a ball, 
and it's stopping you and you're slowing you down. So why why are Aquarius being slowed down? Why are they stopping? Because you're veering off the path. Um, you're possibly going towards a toxic relationship. They were trying to veer you away from that. There's also you're too focused on money. Money isn't everything. You know what I mean? Obviously it's very important and spirits aren't in the physical so they don't really understand money a lot of the time because we're the we're the humans who are kind of here with the finances so get get organized with your finances um but don't let it rule your life focus on it and get it out of the way okay um how can they improve their finances this month um organization and and clarification get get cl get clarity on how much you're earning possibly um numbers like there's an element of like organizing your finances and really focus on that because i feel like you're not focusing on that i feel like you're trying to you're like you don't want to see i don't want to see um so i'm getting that financial discipline yeah and self-discipline yeah be be disciplinary with yourself if that's the right word disciplinary i don't know if that's the right word but be disciplined with yourself Get things in order. Everything's just so messy, guys. Aquarius, what are you doing? It's like messy. And it's like, oh shit, whatever. I just, you just got like a, I thought like you just got a pile of papers and you're just like, fuck it. <laughs> and you're like, no, pick those papers up and sort them out. <laughs> I don't know what it means, guys. There's something there. Action. It's a student individuality. Now is the perfect time to act. Take inspired action towards your dream. Move forward with confidence. I feel like you're, some of you guys are saying, but it's not my fault, it's not my fault. That's fine, guys. If it's not your fault and you can't control it, just let it go. But if it is something you can control, then definitely look into it. We've also got adventure with self-discipline. Okay. Dare to do things differently. Manifest your travel dreams. Move to a new location. Yeah. Cool. So, we also have receive. Be open to receiving goodness. Believe you are worthy of abundance. The gift is coming to you soon. Okay. Which is so cool love that so receive let yourself receive um let your friends compliment you as well i feel like you're getting compliments and you're just like no actually focus on that <laughs> why are you ignoring it why okay this is really this is like a really big message why are you ignoring the signs why are you ignoring your friends possibly why are you ignoring gifts um receive it i got a really itchy throat Sorry guys, I've got a really itchy throat. Oh, there's just so much communication that's not being had. Guys, what are you doing, Aquarius? You guys are really in it this month. Jeez. I feel like you're not connecting with a partner. Um, especially if you people who are in who are a girl watching this who is with a guy. You're not really communicating with your boyfriend very well. Like this is the energy now. What what are you missing? What are you not talking about? Don't be scared. <laughs> you can do it. Take the action. Do the damn thing. You can do it. Right, so love. Ace of Wands. Yep, communicate. Get that olive branch out. This is to do with friendship as well. I feel like some of you, you've been dismissing a lot of your friends. Uh, take the action and go forward with it and ask your friends out to hang out. Um, you could be focused a lot more on your relationship than your friends as well. So really be aware that your friends need time with you as well as your partners. And with temperance, definitely balance out both friendships and relationships. Because I feel like you're very relationship orientated this month. And if you are single, you're either spending too much time alone and not being with friends. And a lot of people want to be around you. Um, so I definitely feel like there's an energy of like, go 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 like the universe is like come on Aquarius you can do it pick up the pace I feel like you're lagging a bit for some reason um no shame everyone's on their own path um I feel like someone's gonna kick you up the bum and say oi come out with me or let me show you let me show you don't know what that means let's just let me show you could be a for you singles there's a guy coming in he's saying let me show you Ooh. Let me show you what you could have. Don't be scared. For some of you guys, you are getting an offer and you're scared of it. They're saying, don't be scared, it's fine. Um, I'll help you, I'll guide you. And then we got the four of wands. I'll guide you, got a new foundation. Some of you guys, you could be uh, talking about, um, I don't know why this is not focusing. Um, focus on, 
connection this month being connected with people in your life make sure you're not leaving anyone out i feel like this is so random i feel like the more you leave people out the more you're going to be left out there's something about you clinging on to something that you don't need to cling on to anymore we have the ace of pentacles in the reverse so there's a sense of holding on to things that you don't need to be holding on to anymore I feel like this is old. This is old energy. This could also date back to your childhood and you holding on to things out of security and being like, there's not enough, there's not enough, I need to keep this for myself. Possibly for you guys, you could be um, hoarders as well. No, it's a shame. If you possibly have too much clutter, some things need to be let go of. Um, possibly take, give some clothes to charity or sell them. There's just a need to kind of like, let go, Aquarius. Let go. Come on, guys, you can do it. Like... Oh, I feel I feel bad for you guys because I feel like you guys are really in it this month. I really hope this is resonating for you guys because I'm feeling like this is so intense. For me, this feels like a water sign energy. Like I feel like if, if you've got a water sign moon, that like, this is really gonna connect with you. I feel like just let go. I feel like I'm I'm feeling like tears running down my face, but I'm not actually crying. So I feel like a lot of you guys are just feeling so sad. Like right now, it's feeling so sad, guys. This is gonna improve. Okay, keep focusing on yourself um work on what's going on inside of you and communicate how you really feel to your friends to your relationship to your partner to yourself um and it's going to be good we've finally got the four of wands it's going to be good i think a fire sign is going to come in and help you to be more relaxed there's just an element of stubbornness or like coldness i'm getting just the color gray it's just so prominent right now just let it release let it come out so let's have a look at finances Definitely an element of finance with financial discipline. Um, you're basically not listening to your boss this month for some reason I'm getting. Um, but I feel like it's, you want to be on your own terms this month. I feel like Libra energy is really kicking your bum. And basically you're getting really irritated at a lot of things, which I am as well. Don't worry about it. <laughs> this Libra energy is intense. And we've got the three of pentacles. So you could have, you could have to kick your colleagues up the bum and say, oh, you need to put your work in as well. You may be like the leader in your career this month. I see you leading a role. So you could be getting a new job where you're a leader. Of, um, even a professor. I'm getting professor, um, a lecturer, um, a nurse, doctor. Someone in quite a strong position. A really itchy finger as well. That's strange. I was seeing if it was my engagement finger. It, it's not the engagement finger. It's, it's not on the wrong hand as well anyway. Uh... Yeah, you're being pointed at. This is my pointing thing. I feel like you're being pointed at and saying you need to take the lead. You need to take the role here. You may be um, in a group setting and then you're basically taking the, the, the lead in this situation and having to be the boss, which is quite unusual for you for some reason. They're telling me it's not really something you normally do. High Priestess. Very intuitive this month. Yep, King of Wands is coming up again. So you may meet this person through career. Um, and they may be just helping you in terms of like a new start, okay? And we also have the Magician. So new things are starting to manifest. Um, yeah, you guys, this is coming up again. So I feel like you guys are really stuck. But it's going gonna, it's gonna to get better, okay guys? Just focus on being the leader. Let yourself be seen. Um, and new things are starting to manifest. So the more you come into your own power, the more you look at yourself and say, Hey, I deserve this. More is going to come in. I have got the song, if you're happy and unite, clap your hands. <laughs> um, and I also got um, the hokey cokey. Um, so I feel like you need to kind of bring in a lot more kind of like loving energy, like happy fun. You know, like 80s music where it's like really fun and happy. I feel like you need to get a lot more of that energy within your life. Kind of possibly do some dancing, do some dancing in your room or like put some loud music on and just boogie. Uh, possibly do a hobby that you haven't done for a while. Do that. I'm getting do that career that you've always wanted to do, or start it, or look for it. You know, for some of you, I feel like you're singers as well, and I feel like you're definitely going to be looking into that this month. <clears throat> you're able to conjure up what you want, and you're able to do that. Okay, the world is at your feet, and you can go forward. You just got to take that first step. And I don't know if that's very helpful, but that's what they're telling me. And the world is your oyster. And I'm seeing an oyster with like a pearl inside. And you're going to take that this month. So 
um, because before you wouldn't have taken it, but now you're actually taking it, which is the receive. And she's actually holding almost like a pearl. So you're definitely going to um, work on your element of receiving and um, giving and receiving as well. And learning to receive more and learning to possibly give more as well. And just feeling safe within yourself. Okay, guys, so thank you so much. Uh, I feel like the overall energy for you guys is to just get the overall, sorry, the overall advice for you guys is just to get organised for your finances as well. Uh, let go, let your guard down, you're safe, and sort out your finances. <laughs> okay, thank you so much, guys. Get organised. You can do it. You can do it. So thank you so much, guys. If this resonated, give it a big old thumbs up, comment down below, subscribe to my channel if you would like to. Um, if you would like to get a private reading with me, all the information is down below. And I love you guys and I'll speak to you very soon. Have a good October and I hope you guys have a great month. I'll speak to you soon. Bye.